A boil water advisory continues today in Benton, affecting homeowners, businesses, and the Benton Public School District. Today, the district was forced to go virtual because of the lack of water. Yeah, our Alexis Wainwright joining us live with more on this. Alexis, what do we know about this generous donation that apparently was made this afternoon? Have you been able to find out more? Well, Donna and Kevin, because of the ongoing boil water advisory, the doors here at Benton Public Schools are locked. But because of a new partnership between the local dealership and help from the football team, students will be back in here sooner than planned. Our mayor uh, let us know the need out there for the schools to reopen. They had to have water, and that's what we want to do. Thanks to Everett dealerships and a donation of 800 cases of bottled water, Bitten Public Schools will shift back to in-person learning Wednesday. The decision was announced Tuesday as local water line issues continue. A lot of people have struggled for the last several days, and I know that's part of the reason why we haven't been in school this week, so it's big for Everett to step up. This water will be for drinking. School officials said the water in the bathrooms has been deemed safe for hand washing. Now this will help them be able to come back to school quicker. What do you think this means to them? Well, I think they're excited to get back. We had just gotten on a routine a little bit uh, when we come back from Christmas break in our weight room and in classes and things. And I think the guys were, were ready to be in that routine, you know, because nothing has been normal this year. It makes me feel pretty good because I've been at home, been bored, and it's finally been able to come back. And we got the water here, so we don't have to worry about that. You talked about the city and how everyone is helping. Talk about how important that is and how you may hope that this will inspire others to jump in and help. Well, as, as we give, I do hope that others think, well, hey, I can do that too, even if it's one case of water. Now, as far as the rest of school days, they will continue to have virtual Fridays, so no one will be here then. Meanwhile, the city asked on social media for everyone to limit the use of water through Sunday. Reporting live tonight in Benton, Alexis Wainwright, Fox 16 News.